All right, guys, so I'm be showing you how it looks underneath the car. This is a video I've been wanting to do for quite some time, but I can honestly, honestly say I haven't had the time. So, you guys can see here, I have the wagon diff with the wagon axles. And this is a diff mount that I made, okay? You can see here. It's a big plate here in the back. So the back has the wagon axles and these are both uh, the long axles, okay? So normally when you get the diff with the axles, it won't be shorter than the other one. Uh, you will need to buy both of them that are long here. So this is how I have it on mine. And right now what we're doing actually, we're mounting the dry shaft. It. We're working on this side. Don't mind that. And here in the front. All right. Got the transfer case. And you can see how it goes to the back. Really not much to show, it's fairly simple, but it takes a lot of time and a lot of money. A lot of money. <laughs> so, there you go. I've been wanting to make a video of this for quite some time, but you guys can see it. I will go more into details later on, but I just wanted to show the underneath of the, of the car or bottom of the car, you can say. So you see how we made the, that diff mount, we made this ourselves. Um, there was really nobody uh, selling anything in the beginning when I made my car all wood drive. So, see it? 